And it's time once again for more Doom 3. Ah, this is the same uh, Alpha Lab Sector blurb. Let's see. The primary PD reactor feeds into the Hydrocon processes for transport to Sector 2, MFS, refinement and storage. Well, that was very exciting. I um, missed the rest of that last time, you know. So, as you may recall, we nearly do we dodged getting our head deconstructed, wandered through a pipe, shot some guys, learned that the slow zombies can find me better than the fast ones. And that's really about all. Uh, still looking for that Bravo team. Perhaps they're around here somewhere. Not exactly sure where I need to be going from here, so... But I've not been sure where I need to be going from anywhere, so that's nothing new. I guess it's down here. Oh, hello, another zombie. Yep, I'm still a bad shot. Just gonna have to live with that, or die with it. We'll see what happens. So I guess I haven't died yet. Can't say I'm too horrible then. Eh, I probably don't need that, but, you know, I like to be at maximum health. And I imagine I'm going to need something beyond the uh, standard pistol. Oh, hello. Like so. There we go. Pistol would have made life harder there. Did it just get darker? Yeah, it did. <laughs> what, is that all you got? A little darkness and an annoying laugh? I can laugh more annoying than you any day. <laughs> That's right. Oh, zombies. Yeah, I'm shooting in the dark here. I think I prob probably killed that one already. Yep, they're all dead. Alright. Another one? Where? Oh, that one. Can't actually see him too well from here, can I? There we go. That one I shot so hard he disintegrated. Because bullets do that. Didn't you know? I suspect I'm probably not intended to go this direction. At least not as of yet. This is a direction I can go, though. Prefer to have a flashlight out right now. Maybe my shotgun. Zombies! It's been a remarkably shotgun-free level, though that ominous thumping is not doing doing uh, my nerves any favors. Halo! Does he even have a head? He doesn't. Let's get him out here in the light so we can watch him die. I want to know where that brain came from. Something I remembered from the last time I played, that shoot headless zombies and their brains pop out for some reason. I don't know, Doom lighting people. There's a difference between dynamic lighting and dark as hell. And, uh... I think you're going to dark as hell. Maybe I'll poke with the lighting set settings for the next set segment. Clips and the PDA. PDAs are a laugh a minute, as always. Let's see what we learned here. This is what, Jack Smith's? Yeah. What is Jack Hub? He's got an accident report. Audio log for Jack Smith, a benefits analyst in HR 1024 2145. Benefits analyst. I just went through another batch of accident reports from the science team. We've had five more people hurt this week while working with the equipment. The most yep. serious incident was when John Hughes, whose hand was caught in one of the plastic extrusion systems. He was performing maintenance on it and states that he unplugged it and had the safety key in his pocket. 
it managed to activate and got an apparent power source and uh, shredded his arm up to the elbow before someone got him out. So <laughs> a plastic extruder that, that was the, turned off uh, shredded him. The machine is still running and we can't shut it down. The cost on that incident alone is enough to raise the red flag, but this is, is the one so they have machines we're going to overrun our budget on benefits that do damage that they can't shut while down. It's not my department, I have you ever see the mangler? The equipment budget is going to be blown out as well because, according to these reports, the equipment's breaking down on a daily basis. Had Robert Please mark this for review at corporate. That was a very wacky one. That was exciting. What's he got? Uh, what else has he got on his PDA here? Safety protocols. And when a buddy system and routine maintenance is being performed, should be shut cut down on claims. And how the hell is a buddy system going to do anything with accident claims except double them? Tell me the buddy system would have prevented Joe Torso Boy Moss from having his arms and legs hacked off by the Albuquerque Accelerate Capacitor. <laughs> Maybe his buddy would have heard the thing growl and engage without power or a CRF module? Maybe his buddy's hair would have burst into flames instead, saved us the trouble of needing to run and find water to put him out. I'm not sure to follow the logic on that, but the pure sarcasm is still alive and well, if nobody else is alive and well, at least. Okay, so this is the room. This has got the zombies in it. Climb up here. Oh, it's the way we came. Okay, I got turned around. It's fine, it's fine. So, let's see. We were down here, we shot a bunch of zombies, went through a door, right? Came into here, we shot more zombies. I got a PDA up here. And if I wander around up here, I find no door. No door. So obviously there must be another way. Maybe I do have to jump through the uh, Bernie. So, yeah, that's a thing that occurs. Well, let's go ahead and jump through here and see what happens. Worst that can happen is I have to reload, right? The burning! Oh, God! Hey, I made it through. But I only have two life. What else is here? Uh-oh. I'm scared. I don't think I should have done that. Oh, and I walked right into the fire. Reloading. Hmm. So, that does appear to be a way I should be going. But perhaps not the way I should get there. Oh, there's another door up here. Wait, this is the way I came, isn't it? Curse it. Alright, fine. Starting to get confused, guys. I don't know. What if that's the extruder? The one of legend. So the Mangler was a lot of fun. It's got Robert England in it. He's always exciting. Oh, here we go. Seal breach. Gas leak stopped. Extinguished. I find Robert England amusing. He is the most, uh, the sleaziest looking man in the universe when he's on screen. He's a very nice guy in real life. There we go. What, a guy can't talk about movies? Hell out of movies. Nobody can stop me. I guess it's me. But what would be the point of doing the, watching this Let's Play if that was the case? Ha! They are helpless before me. And my might. Got a bunch more ammo for this now. I gotta keep switching it up occasionally, otherwise I run out. And that was just no good at all. 
see, I could jump down there, I guess. There's a door right over here. I'm sure I can make it through. Eh, let's just go through the door. This way it's less likely for things to sneak up on me. I do hate it when I get snuck up on. I have to go... Ah! Oh, hey! That's he. So are you uncomfortable? Ah! You summoned the horrible monsters. By being a horrible monster. Why'd you do that? Uh-oh. Got me reloading. Well, that wasn't so bad. Uh-huh. Can't kill that guy. Oh well. So I'm not, I can't remember what those little two-headed guys are called. I have to come up with a name for them. Yeah. Looks like more taffy has been extruded. Maybe that's what the extruder does. Delicious taffy! Well, we'll follow the hint and go under the ground here. In Crawlway 13, according to the label there. Oh, hello. Oh, damn it. Too late. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. It's kind of fun, though. Alright, fine. Whatever. It's only a little bit of health. I can survive. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, look at that. I can survive just fine now. Jumpy. And I think that's all we need in here, so we gotta go back to that other place with all the bodies. <sighs> that just the way. They never send you the place with the candy. <laughs> or the ladies. A player would like to be sent to the place with the ladies. I guess the imps could be the ladies. There's no, uh... No really way to, real way to tell as far as I'm aware. Oh hey, there's another one. I am a bad shot. But I guess they die and I don't, so that's really all that matters. Now oh, we're getting into a little bit of a maze-like sort of passageway here. I'm going to call it good for this portion. I'll see you guys back in, uh, you know, an indeterminate amount of time for part, uh, whatever it is, 12, I think.